Welcome back to the Hand of Fate. We've got a new thing to kill. It's the the Jack of Dragons. Let's see. In combat, projectiles travel half speed, but also do double damage. And cooldown timers are doubled. Those are both Will not very bad. First? Deck it builder. Uh, I think hero. I just hit do it yourself. I don't. I don't even want to know what's in it. I don't even want to know. It could be good. It could be bad. I don't care. Um, we're gonna win. My symbols, but now we begin to play in earnest. My scepter is at Look at stake. This. Look at the deck. Oh! I do not intend to lose it. I'm gonna win a scepter. Yeah. It's cool, man. You can try to keep it, but I'm gonna win that fancy jester's cap stick. Scales. I have saved the lizard men for now, but the stakes have been raised. There is no Spider. weapon I will not use against you. Well, I don't. I'm not worried because I've got the helpful priest. Hello. I'll give you half my food. Just for a small spread. You know, it's only half. It's only. Is it 19? It's 19 or 10. Desire. Six of shit. I was so close. One of these days with a huge success. Ah, treasure picker. Many of these blessings are too good for the likes of you. Oh man. Uh, when I get to choose an equipment, I get to pick between two. And I lose ten food. <laughs> Heroes remains. So often, this is how the story ends, is it not? You pass the a funeral. Dries, the hero dies. Their memory is Jesus Christ! Stop talking. But they are lost. It's obvious from the signs of the proceeding that the deceased was a well-loved figure. You're approached by the cleric. This great hero fell to defend our beloved town of Wandermere. His sword and shield are powerful artifacts and must be returned to his hometown for proper burial rites completed. Will you do this, Traveler? I will do that for him. Thank you. This will mean the world is family. The town would uh, have a revolt had these artifacts not been returned. It's not, uh, see, it's not far to the hero's homestead. We looked at the baby there. Okay. Oh, a Viking blade. Such an elegant use of rage and anger. You wouldn't expect it of the barbarian hordes. In the pain shield. And shield bash deals damage to its opponent. Cool. I'm, I'm As going to deliver it, you. though. In hurry. It spies on the spirits of the dead by delaying these proper burial rites. Heavy burden. After five steps. Ha. Holy shit. Let's see how you progress with that millstone around your neck. Of course, you can remove your curses at shops if you can find them. The heroes Still, return. I'm keen to see how you handle your disadvantages. I will happily wager on the outcome. I do not think you have what it takes. You reach the warman's hometown of the dead adventurer. The town cleric meets you at the gate. Appears to be standing vigil. Return the hero's sword. Thank you. This blade will once again be wielded by in righteous fury. Do you also have his shield? I'll also return his shield. You truly have done almighty work returning this shield. Thank you. Ah, blessed are we. Protected. Can... Well, what? <laughs> Can't foul those who trespass us again. Draw two blessed cards and the token's mine. The gods look upon you favorably. At the beginning of every turn, the old gods throw down thunder upon enemies. Holy shit, that's awesome. Useful. On a hit, the player inflicts two more damage for each blessing they possess. Oh my god, I'm gonna do six bonus damage. I got three blessings. The token is yours. And I get Let us see that cool copper. With your new found ability. And cool, I didn't lose 50 health. The forest escape. We need more food. Uh, let's take the forest, of course. There's nothing else to do here. Next leg of the adventure. So far, I I'm winning. I appreciate your efforts. I worked hard on this game. It is a pleasure to see you play. A ship at dock is worth nothing until it sails. A smuggler's wharf. This token will unlock more cards if you can defeat this encounter. No, which port? It's a little more than wooden plates sticking out over the water. It is a den of inquiry. Visitors in inquiries. An obvious bleh. You spend your time. <laughs> well, what am I doing here? Okay. You found a way to see. Steal some logs. Bribe the worker. Let's see. I'm going to steal, steal some logs. I'm going to drink with the captain. I'm not going to steal the logs. Let's see. And what passes for a bar in the shanty town? You find the ship's captain drowned in her sorrows. Or I'm sorry because her drowned. Blah, blah, blah. She's drinking a, a bunch of brandy. Okay. You pull a stone next to her. And while I'm crying about her misfortunes, attempt to find out. Well, she may know about the missing boats. You can tell the captain knows something, but she's not parting with it yet. However, she's pleased to have your company. I'm gonna drink more with her. Drink more. 
You gulped another small glass of terrible, terrible brandy. The captain is merry and regales you with stories of her adventures upon the high seas, but nothing regarding the recent boat disappearances. You feel the effects of the parable of the powerful brandy. You still have your wits about you, though. One more drink. Go for another small glass of the terrible, terrible brandy. In a drunkenness, the camera reveals too much about itself. It's sadly they got nothing but the ships. I'm fuzzy with the warm haze. The local pickpocket reveals you some gold. I don't have any gold. Drink more. Small glass of terrible, terrible brandy. After many drinks, the camera reveals what, what she knows. Finally. Uh, one thing. Hi, Bender. And we'll say nothing more of the matter. You plan to head to the lot, do you can do. Tokens down mine. So I got pissed drunk. Moving on. The maiden. I need supplies, maiden. I need supplies. Two food cards. Ooh, three food. I'm sure you're grateful for Three more food. Fantastic. Now I'm good. The shop. Well, we'll just pass this right on by. Because we have no money. Moving on. To the stairs. How we we not Deeper fought anything our yet? Foe. What brings oh, you to shit. play the game? Ha. I know you will not tell me. Like all the rest. Uh, you I'm are silent. Turn back. There's too much adventure to possibly be had. See? The tavern wager. Taverns, caves, dungeons, and the roads between them. Over and over again and again. You find yourself in a seedy old tavern, spitting tales of your adventures at a group of drunkards. A drunk soldier said, Great hero, I wager five gold you cannot catch an arrow in flight. I accept, because I can probably catch an arrow in flight. It's, I mean, how fast are arrows? Speed of an arrow, not that fast. I grabbed it, I got five gold. Let's arrow fly across the room, and this is the kind to catch it. Gain five gold. See? Suck it. The noble trader. All right, I haven't been this guy yet. mind, or simply noble by birth. He casts a little more than a glance at me. Oh fuck you! Rat, the there we go. That's rats. Can you press on? Let's fuck these guys up. We are really low on food. Like dangerously low on food. All right. Basic axe, basic shield, but got super bonus damage. Look at this. Get fucked up. Ow. I may have forgotten that Q is the counter button. There we go. None of this. Boom! Boom! Rat Smasher. Now hopefully these rats will have like 12 food. Then it'll all be worthwhile. Fuck the Noble Trader. They didn't have shit. Well, now we're out of food. What an ignominious way to go. I do hope you find something to eat soon. Next part of the adventure. Okay, it's only... Did oh, you God. expect me to tell Come on. your fortune? Devil's Choice, fantastic. Let's give me some stuff. A fortune teller is at their most base and despicable when they begin to believe their own lies. A cloaked devil appears in your path. I am different. I'm here to test your might, so called hero. Are genuine. Choose your foe. Well, if I have to choose a foe, we're gonna go. Are those lizards? Uh, I think a more. That, 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 that looks harder. Let's go with the harder one. Plus, the bandits. Bandits are easy to kill. They don't have special powers like fire breath or magic bolt, sir. Fuck you! Behold the power of the gods! There we go. I do so much damage. I better not lose from like, starving to death. Not when I have so much damage. Well done. Get 23 gain cards. Three gain cards. Shit. Alright. Uh, that's just that. What does this one do? Reveal stairs. Uh, gold bonuses. Mm. That might be worth it. What does this one do? I think this is just holy damage, isn't it? Well. Prepare for bad times. Savor the good. Ah, fuck. 15 gold. Come on, food. Shit. Well, that's almost like food. The pendulum can swing both ways. Well, I didn't mean to take that weapon, but since I did, let's just throw that back on there. I want to take the helmet, because there's better weapons than that. Alright. 
Something with food. Shit. All right. Tinkerer, he might have food. We got 20 gold. We can probably buy some food. That's all we can afford, though. We can't buy, like, an sweet gloves. Um, I'm gonna... You know, I do want to. I do want to see. I'm curious. I'm curious what he has to buy, like, sell. Ooh, the life's limb. Oh, a sweet mage mask, the timed heel, and the chrome dome. Well, we need this very badly. Food so is crucial for healing. Six, I think. If you travel Five. without food, that's fine. Your strength will not be restored between encounters. That's fine. You'll we have also five begin food. to starve. It seems you'll learn that soon enough, though. Shut up. Fine. Two, three. Asleep in the inn. What sort Method. of scoundrel would go through a sleeping man's belongings? Let's see. While asleep at the inn, you jolt away to find a bandit rifling through your belongings. You're quick to your feet, weapon already in hand. The bandit laughs. Easy there, princess. Spare an apple, would you? There's a good lad. He stands unsteadily, clutching a stolen apple and some coins. Let's see. You grab his arm and protest and earn a punch in the face. Look there, Nancy. Here wants to fight. The Van Lassino spits at your feet and turns to leave. Attack that son of a bitch. With one practice swing, you execute him. With surprise, you guys the last sound he makes. Suddenly, the room fills bandit lackeys. Heh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Whatever. No one takes my apple in two gold. <laughs> it cost that man his life. <laughs> Fuck you guys. I'm... Beyond powerful. Get out of here. Get out of here. I executed him with a hammer. It's pretty impressive. Bong. Tap in the wrist. Now, drop down like 20 food, and we'll be okay. I'll, maybe I won't kill you. Thieves dealt with. You accidentally wipe your brow with a hand, slick with the blood that had run down your weapon. Oh man, it turns out I'm hoping to find a. Oh uh, fuck. So let's see. You took the life so easily. Are you already lost? Remember who you are, who you were. I have lingered too long. It drained so. Do not forget me. Who is this ghost? Shit! I should have left it alone. Who is this fucking ghost? Ladder escape. I have to avoid that. I can't go back. I can't go back. It would cost me like six food. I can't run the risk of not getting food. Yeah, we go straight heart. line. All games are about power, are they not? Listen, I know about your power the rant. Acquiring of the fuck? power, the retaining of power, and most importantly, the use. The jack of playing already. I mean, am I gonna win? What's up, buddy? No, we're going after the jack of scales. Ow! Fuck! Don't poison me. Come on now. Stop it! Oh my god! Jesus! Stop! Stop! <laughs> just, just chill out for a sec. How can I? Oh, I can't dodge that. Oh my god! Okay, you cal you calm the fuck down. I want to beat the shit out of you. Come on! There you go. Fuck you! I've got super blessings of the gods. I don't need your shit. What's in my backpack? Is that a map? All right, one food card, yes! Buy food, we're not dead yet. Oh, traveling healer, I've got one gold. He won't do shit for me. Pass him by. I need a, I need a better shield. Ah, the Imbatan hero. That may lead you down many paths towards jealously guarded secrets. Come across an injured adventurer, battered and bloodied army. Tells you see, he's seen combat recently. Ask him when he's troubles. Ah, oh, I've been chasing a pack of thieves that attacked my home village in Nibbertown. I killed some of them in an ambush, but I fear I lack the strength to, case to chase the rest down. If you have any honor, you'll find those jackals and make them pay. Aha. Oh, I'll be the Nibbertown hero. Don't mind if I do. Maze of traps. Enter the cave. Traps don't scare me, as long as I'm not bear traps. The worst type of trap. Alright, I see those are bear traps over there, uh, and I know a bear trap when I see it. 
It's all about taking this lead. Just gotta avoid the. I gotta avoid the smoke. Oop. See, just gotta avoid that stuff. Ow, fuck. Easy peasy. Oh, another two hit by an arrow. Oh, and a bear trap in the face. Ah. Ooh. Just, 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 just roll, 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 roll. Oh my god, I'm very low on health. Bear traps, man, always get you. Three gang cards, yes. 20 gold, don't need that. I need 20 gold, Jesus. Well, okay. Take two, keep one. What does this do? Now this oh, is my magic kind missiles. of magic. Death and the transmutation of energy. And the fool's gold was what? Uh, weapon usage? I don't have a weapon usage yet, so that's kind of not good. I mean, I can hope to get the hammer and use it, but let's just take that. Alright, I'm going to become a hero. Chip on these gloves. Truly the work of a master craftsman. The Ember Town There's hero. A token in it for you if you win. I've caught up with the Ember Town village raiders who call, Stay your hand, adventurer. We'll share the spoils with you. Refuse and deal with the bandit scum. You tell them to ask their gods for more mercy, mercy than you're about to show them. That's only four bandits. And we're worse than that. I mean, if I kill them, I'll get all the spoils. Right? That's how it works, right? Give me that shit. Get in my face. Oh my god. I'm just shooting beams everywhere. I guess it just shoots at random. Or was it on a counter? Either way, I wasn't paying attention. Shooting magic missiles. What do I get? Three gang cards. 15 health. Need to that. Give me some food. One food. Not nearly enough. Three food. That's more like it. I'm sure you are grateful for that. Let's see. Insanity. Uh, in Amber Town, some guy. I, I missed that first line. Insanity. He hands you a jeweled ring, then dies. You put the ring away to identify fight later and find uh, and bury the fallen champion. Car token is now mine. Okay, so the guy I met in the forest, he made it back to town. And that ring was a was his way of saying thank you. Next up, my journey. Next to the cave. We gotta go find that dragon. Do you understand what it is we do now? Dead Man's Gorge! Or did I rush you through the rules, pushing you into the plague before you It's another prepared. ambush on the rope bridge. Good thing we can handle three mages. Little they know, I've got a few mage powers of my own. In the wrath of the gods! Hey, like that. Yeah, you weren't expecting it. Super powerful mage. Maybe next time don't put a book in front of your face on a necklace. Then you'll see it coming. Too busy reading. Two gang cards. Ah, things are starting to look up. A little food. Fantastic. Change, food is going but great. Enough to switch the odds a little. The twisted cannon. There's a weapon glinting down there. I need to go find that weapon. I could really use my stun stamp, my stun hammer, or always that card, or the free sword. All that shit. Scorching zeal. Oh, it's a fiery aura. Okay. Sure, put that on there. Just oh, not for fire golems. She's not a fire golem. Hungry mouse. How's it going? You meet a peasant woman. Greeting a stranger. What has been hard for the family this year? Uh, let's see. I'm going to give her five food. The woman takes your food eagerly, passing to uh, the children rush to the forest, hands outstretched. You have given us enough food to survive the winter, stranger. She retrieves a sack from behind the bushes. This is my husband before he dies. Please accept it. It's worth it. It's worth it to help out the kids. It's just the mace. Your husband has some shit gear. That's it. Treasure chest. Oh, we're going for it. Let's see. Approach the treasure chest. It's a 50-50 chance. 50-50. But we all know it's just second card. Fuck. <laughs> More fails than wins with my 50-50s. I hear a click. Poisonous gas. Oh, my God. A lot of failure there. Well, 25% chance. More like 100% chance for failure. Lose 15 max health. Okay, I'm, I'm at full health now. I'm at the chest. Attempt to open it. 75% chance of 
success, which really means 75% chance to not fuck it up. But we fucked it up. Of course we fucked it up. Always fuck it up. Well, that was a huge waste of time. Thanks, game. Traveling mage. God, three fails in a row. A chance to buy more. Maybe we should stop picking the second card. You must be relieved. I am relieved. I want to see what else he has. Uh, press two to attack faster. Curse. Draw two. When you draw, when you have supplies, draw two and pick one instead. And eh. receive bonus health into combat. How much is that? Thirty-three. I can't afford it. No point if I if I die. Oh my god! This guy's fucking ripping me off. Four. I'm gonna go with five. Can I buy anything for ten gold? No. Can I sell this shitty axe? Like I don't I don't need this one. This one's weak. That shitty thing. I need a better helmet. Killing enemy launches missiles. Oh! 21 gold now. Now what can I buy for 21 gold? Nothing. This dude's prices are too steep. It's it's a buyer's market. You can't be you can't be selling at high prices when gold's so hard to come by. Economics 101.3. Well, this escape ladder is taking me down. It's not really where you go to escape. The lizard men are nothing if not patient. He waits for you. Ah, a traveling jeweler. Why not? We'll see if we can buy for 21 gold from a traveling jeweler. All else fails, I can see some new cards. Alright, take me in. What do we got? Mercy contract, time heal, heal his ring, or... Ooh, feathered ice. During combat, press 2 to create a blast of freezing ice. It's 39 gold, I can't afford that. But I can't afford... One of these. Yes, I'll leave. Fuck you for ripping me off. All right. Dead Man's Gorge again. I'm sure it's While traveling not cool, another Dead rope bridge, there's another reason. ambush. Ah, scales. Now we'll see if fire hurts the lizard people. Does fire hurt you? Yes. Yes, it does. Fire hurts the shit out of you. Pop. Get out of here. Get out of here, lizard man. I don't need your shit. Two gang cards. 15 gold. Five food. Fantastic. Can I gain a weapon? Oh, Battle of the Brook Top. These places are rife with power. It is not chance that you should meet a warlock here. A light draws you to a nearby hilltop where you see a warlock. Disappear into a cloud of sulfur, leaving behind summoned minions. The Jack of Dust and three dust people. That's fine, the Jack of Dust is it's cake. It's literally made of cake. That's why it's so easy to kill. Fuck you dudes! Suck magic powers. Pow! Oh! All you need to do is to kill a couple of your minions. Some magic balls take care of the rest. Get out of here. What the? Oh, there's a booby trap there. Well, don't go over there now, Jesus. Hey, like that. Hey, like. Oh. oh, hit me. It's okay. We got magic balls to hit him with. Yeah! They're really fucking strong. <laughs> what you got? Hammer up the butt. That's what you got. Feel the sting of the fire mace. I lost a little over 20 health. We'll make it back. Got plenty of food. Just wander around, back and forth, heal up. Should get some sweet gang cards. Two gang cards. Five max health. 20 more. God damn. I'm sure you are grateful for that. It's so much money. <laughs> Nothing to buy. Back this way. This way. Oh, the devil's carnival. At its heart. These traveling shows are but mockeries of the true mysteries. One day, just as dust gathers, you reach a large country town hosting a traveling circus. Strange sights and even stranger smells confront you. As you begin to water between the tents and stalls, 
Okay, okay what's happening here? Peasants, nobles on the streets. All right, here we go. There's someone about the place that dulls your senses, and for a while, you forget your quest. Forget even the path that brought you into this place. Continue. Oh. Oh, it's, it's a huge failure. Which means... This Truth is a huge failure options. card. It's a fucking failure. God damn it. It's always a failure there. The black cat darts a weed with your legs, attracts you the wrong turn, wandering back down to the dark alley. Mr. Carnival awaits you. Okay. It can't be a failure twice in a row. Like eight times in a fucking row. Huge success! A muffled call for help brings your attention to the Hall of Mirrors. You stride inside, weapon in hand. In the reflected gloom, you can see a cloaked figure moving, but you cannot tell which direction or how close they are. After some time, you come across a small, dark pool on the ground. A few coins lie scattered about, stained in red, the blood of their previous owner. One gang guard. Ten gold! Rich, bitch! You continue to make your way through the mirrors and find only... You find no other signs of life until you re uh, rejoin the crowd. As you walk away, you wonder what kind of thieves would take the person and leave their gold. Soon, it leaves your memory. Some time later, you find yourself standing on the edge of the forest. Sound of the crown behind you. Day is just dawning. A witch day. Looking back, you see the ruined buildings of a country town. Long ago about Haunted Cav Carnival! Jack of Scales, well, there he is. Now, a fight for the ages. I expect greatness. Ah, potency allows him to fucking kill my, my magical powers. Well, fuck. <laughs> it goes on my benefit. Okay, only four dudes. Come on. Come on. Come on. Skip. There he is. There's that beaked asshole. What does he know about power? Um, this... These guys look like they're on fire. Holy shit! Watch out for his tail. Luckily, the Wrath of the Gods killed one of them. And he killed another. What was this to do with this? There we go. This is going to be a very long fight. Bop, bop, bop. Nope, nope. Not going to get hit by that. I'm going to punch you in the face. Just got to take him out one at a time. Oh my god! <laughs> Alright. Somebody attack. With somebody can block. I can't, I can't counter that! Could've counted that. Could've counted that. Finally! Alright, that lizard on the far end should only have like one HP left. Got you to your backside. Now die, die, die. Oh! Come on! Just, it's the longest fight ever. Don't want to be cornered by you both, you assholes. Yeah, that's right. It's fingertail. Now suck triple magic blasts. Then my fury. Feel my rage. That's right. You're going down, big guy. <laughs> Piece of cake. Actually went better than the king of dust. We had some food issues to begin with, but we ended up doing pretty well. And the Jack of Scales is dead. Mm. What that would have been, though. Well played. That's well right. Well played indeed. I've got your scepter. You have defeated My movement speed increased. That I never you start with more food. Your starting gear has been upgraded. Ratmen have more strength. Bandits have more health. Lizardmen 
have more strength. I've got just goblet and just stick. What now, guy? The wand represents my will in the purest sense. It is not too late for you to give up now. No, no, I'm gonna take Go all your peacefully, all your artifacts, and leave me to mine. You begin to assemble a credible deck. Let us see what happens next. All right, what was this for? Return the belongings of the dead hero. I get 10 gold per blessing. Oh, that's pretty good if you get a lot of blessings. And the war cry. Pop. For infiltrating the, the uh, port, you receive the landlocked lover too. For defeating the bandit who looted Embertown, you receive the ring of justice. For exploring the brook, hi brook top hill, you receive 25 gold and the altar. As a reward for de defeating my lizardman Jack, you receive the Queen of Skulls. Ooh, she looks cool. Metal ore. That is that is a hunk of iron on a stick. I guess it's a mace then. Holy Forge. It, well, that's a play on words because it's full of holes. And dark rituals again. One of these things. Here we go. Pop that open. But being my lizard and Jack, you also receive Robert Baratheon's helmet in the undead vein. Halfway done. Let us continue. And all these cards still. The next time, I guess we're taking on the Queen of Bones. See you then.